Hello, my dear friends, and welcome to my channel. If you are watching this video, you want to get an honest review of Vangage, and especially its AI ads generator for Facebook, for example. I will guide you through the process of how to create one in this video. That's why stay tuned and, of course, check out all the links and information below this video in the description box. And, of course, click the subscribe button if you still didn't do it to get updated on the new videos. Let's go. So yes, my goal today is to create a Facebook ad, uh, which will be created by Vengage's um, AI engine. The link is right below this video for this procedure. But what I do here is I'm clicking on design AI. I'm choosing social media and here I have a banner. I have Instagram, LinkedIn, Facebook, so on and so forth. I'm choosing a banner. I already have a predefined request that I want to um, work for me. So for example, it's going to be the Facebook ads with e-commerce e-commerce uh, e app that I'm promoting with some um, testimonial driven copy so on and so forth some three point bullet uh, three bullet point uh, benefits of the of the uh, of the app so on and so forth so what i do next i click on generate a banner it takes just a matter of seconds i think 10 to uh, up to 20 seconds let's wait but for you the time flies very fast so my uh, banner is created what i do next is clicking on continue editing my first thing is i want to see what has been generated i'm obsessed i found the cutest dress for a wedding and got so many compliments the shipping was super fast too 10 out of 10 recommended verified shopper so uh, the first thing that i'm doing is clicking on brand kit i can explore different plays uh, for my ad uh, whatever is more appealing or just matches the vibe of my application or company then i choose um, the font that would be the best for this type of content let's go like with this one and yes after this you of course can uh, do any um, alternations but Yes, they will happen in AI tools, in templates, for example, in text icons. You can add any icon that you want to your um, uh, to your banner or um, uh, infographics. It's up to you. Yes, what I want to do now is uh, design feedback to get the feedback from AI engine. What exactly could be made better? So what I see right now, enhanced text contrast for improved readability. Uh, text on certain backgrounds colors has low contrast, making it difficult to read for all users. It could be also true because of the white text. I can barely see it whenever it goes together with some other, for example, the grayish colors. Okay, let's go further. Uh, clarify information hierarchy with distinct headings. Headings are not visually distinct from body text. Uh, hindering quick uh, content scanning and comprehension. I also agree there could be like some title the, that would catch my attention as a reader, as the person that would need to spend money on something that I'm promoting, so on and so forth. Increase spacing between content blocks. Uh, sections of information are too close uh, together. Yes, there could be some good paragraphing of the text. I can rescan design and get some more information. I can replace some moments, for example, or I can modify some of the things for sure. Uh, let's go with next uh, things that are available right here is generate, not generate icons, but generate images. Uh, generate, generate uh, a, a phone in a hand. Okay, let's see what's gonna happen. So basically, that could be a solution, you know, uh, for example, replacing the original uh, picture, maybe I could still uh, work better with uh, the AI image generator, telling that uh, the phone needs to be facing the screen or it needs to be facing uh, the screen of the reader. And then I could place some of the text right there, but so on and so forth. It's still easy to do it whenever you need some picture of something different. It was just my suggestion of what could be created. 
But yes, and after you are done with all your alternations, whatever you wanted to edit or to change or to generate some elements, charts, uh, uh, so on and so forth, you can preview your product. And after this, you can share that. You can share that uh, with the team member entering the email address. You can uh, create a private link. You can then load it when different formats, for example, PDF, uh, PNG, PowerPoint, so on and so forth. You click download and you have it on your, on your device. And after this, you are done with the result. So, my friends, thank you very much for being with me and for um, exploring the event gauges possibilities of creating ads for Facebook. And it takes a matter of minutes just to create the whole concept. It's very fast and easy. And you can be sure that your content plan is always up to date. Thank you for watching. I wish you good luck and a lot of success. See you next time. Bye bye.